Hi, good evening to all. Now we are going to look at an important topic on as the straight line trend equation by least on the square method. It's an important on the unit of the business statistics. The unit name is the time series. <coughs> We have now some given data. The first row is year wise, the second one sales data. Through which now we need to find out the trend and the values. The trend equation means it's a simple regression where the x variable is the time variable. It is used to determine the trend in the variable of y which is usually used the forecasting of a sales <coughs> like that the least in a square method means it is a statistical procedure to find the best fit na for a set of data it is now more appropriate method in time series <coughs> so moving forward to now how to calculate the trend values the title would be now fitting the straight line trend and calculating the trend values the first row now would be year the second row sales we name it as y <coughs> then next to the x row we need to the we need to assume the middle value as a zero up to that level now we need to now <coughs> put minus 1 and minus 2 below value as now 1 2 the total of now x now would be the 0 the summation of x equal to 0 then uh, we need to the square in square of x as a 4 1 0 1 4 then we need to multiply with the x and y <coughs> after that we need to total them as a summation x squared equal to 10 and the summation x y equal to 200 the trend values now we need to not denote by yc we need to now look at later now the trend values after now finding the equation the straight line now trend is now yc equal to a plus now px yc now denotes now trend value since now summation x equal to 0 so the values of a and b can be formed as now follows the a variable now is equal to the summation y of n summation y is a 700 <coughs> the n is now 5 how many years that we have used that is now n 700 by 5 equal to 145 140 then b equal to the sigma xy under sigma x squared it is a 200 by the 10 the answer is not 20 so now we need to substitute these values in the equation y c equal to the a plus px y c equal to 140b 140 plus 20x through this equation we need to find the trend values the first year one <coughs> 1979 the x variable value is now minus 2 just now we need to put the value of the x in the equation we get the answer as 100 120 140 160 and 180 these values we need to apply in the table <coughs> under the head of a trend values then we need to now 
totally does the summation of y is equal to the 700. These value now, this value now would be equal to the sales value. Summation y now equal to the summation of the yc. Then only our answer is correct. This way we have to check it out our answer is correct or not. Then we need to estimate the value of sales for the year 1985. <coughs> we know the x variable of 1983 as a 2. So 1984 would be 3. 1985 would be 4. We need to find the, the value, the estimation value of 1985. So the x variable now would be 4. So y is equal to 140, 140 plus not 20. We need to put the x value as 4. <coughs> we need to add the 140 into 80. We get the trend value as now 220. It is the estimation of the estimation value of the sales for the year 1985 thank you <coughs> we will see you again with another session until then stay tuned stay blessed bye